I have anything from Butterfly Crafts and Crochet, so yes, again, I'm putting book chucks together. Um, there's two right here, and then there's this one, and I'm about to put the fourth one together. And you're like, why do you have so many bookshelves? Because I'm in the midst of trying to make a craft cabinet. Now, if you know, uh, um, look up the cabinet, it's called the Dream Box. Yeah, mm -hmm. it's too expensive. So, right now, everything is just going on here. It's kind of got a little or disorganized right now. I've got to go through all this stuff and um, it's um, got to be attached. It's got the handle on the back. But the only problem was, is my friend said, Oh, it'll be perfectly fine with handle on the back. No, it's like within missing. It doesn't even fit quite all the way on the back, so I had to uh, adjust that. Put it on the back, and yeah, okay, so now I gotta move some stuff to in there. And I got the hinges to attach it, so it'll close like this. Only problem is, this is a rock side house. So once I get everything together, everything moved out of the way, I gotta slide the web over this way, which I don't know if I'll be able to or not. I don't know. Because there's no other way to put the, um, the door. It's gonna keep, like, getting caught on the rug. And I tried to tell my friend that too. He's like, what are you talking about? I said, when you go to close the door, it's obviously going to catch on the rug. He didn't know what I was talking about. I'm like, man, are you serious? So, just wanted to show you a little bit of my process of what I'm doing right now. Getting ready to put the last bookshelf together. And when I'm done with it, I will come back and show you how I've Finish it. It's not a mess in here. I mean, mess up on the floor, but you know, what are you doing? I'm putting stuff together. So, but anyways, just wanted to show you a little bit of progress of what I've been doing here. I just wanted to be organized, so I thought this would be a really cool idea. I did see somebody um, make one on uh, YouTube, but yeah. So I mean, I got like a I don't know if it's paneling. It's not paneling. It's like plywood. So it's pretty sturdy. But the thing is, there's it just was not wide enough. So I managed to get it on there. So, but yeah. So once I'm done, I'll take you, show you, take you to a little tour around the whole thing. And then you can see the, see when it's all done. But I just wanted to stop and say hi. How's everybody doing? I have Monday off so I can get half of the stuff done and cleaned up. And who sure does need it? That's for sure. So, but anyways. I'll talk to y'all later and have a great weekend. Bye for now. Hey everybody, it's Dina from Butterfly Clips and Crochet. So I have just a small Dollar Tree haul. Got home a little bit ago, so I just wanted to do some little shopping. Check out the Dollar Tree, see if I can find anything new. Um, I think I come across were these. These little watermelon um, dish mats, so I got these two. And... I love using these so around I my, mean, I got quite a few of them. And then, I only found one, I wanted another one, so, but unfortunately, it was, this was the last one I had, so. Oh, well, so I lucked out on that, so. But hey, you know, if somebody sees in the store, hey, I'll send you a dollar twenty-five plus shipping and all these things. And I also found the plates, which I thought was really cool. So I was like, oh, these are really pretty, so. I got the four plates with the butterflies on them, so they match. So there's those, and then I found this little cup with the butterflies, little drink thing container with butterflies on it too. Oh, well, that's cute. So if I'm ever outside, I could just get something cold to drink in there and be on my way. Then I got this to put on for my eyeglasses, so I can have one uh, pair of glasses on, and then sting the other ones around my neck, so if I need to switch glasses real quick, I'll like, oh, here you go. Ah, oh, sorry. Then I got some masking tape. Sorry, I didn't catch that in time to shut the camera off. I put it on pause. I got masking tape. And then somebody at work said something about they needed some post-it notes, and I said, well, hang on. I said, I'm going... The Dow Tree after work, I said I should be able to find some. So I got these post-it notes. They're pink and there's green in there. And these ones are, I got red and green. So there's those ones. 
And there's like, what, 176 in there. And then I found some more of these notebooks, which I love, and they're so cute. This one has got the, um, the rainbow. This is like half and half. And then you got this half in here. It's lined on this side, but the other side, oops, the other side is plain. There's no lines on the back of it. So I'm the same with this little piece up here. It's got lines on the front, but no lines on the back. So there's that one. And then I got this one with the roller skates on it. thought that was really cute. What I do for work is I keep track of how many phone calls I make a day. And then I compare it to what they put up on the board. Well, what they put up on the board was not right what I had. It was not even close to what I had. And I asked the boss, I said, no, that's not right. I said, I know how many phone calls I make. I said, because I've been keeping track of it. I said, I'd like to know how many phone calls I'm making a day. So I was pretty close to what I made. I made 326 phone calls. And uh, that's what he had. So yeah, see, he told you now. Nah, he had like 240. I was like, no, uh -uh. no, no, I don't think so. There's more than that. So then I got some containers, which I love these containers. They're so pretty. And right now I'm in the middle of organizing everything. And I will show you um, something that uh, I finally finished. Sorry about the table shaking, but I got some of these containers. I got, I think, four of these ones. I got a green one. And then I have a purple one. I love these containers. If you ever find them, scoop them up. And then I got the long ones, which I really like too. Long skinny ones. I got those. Yep. I like those containers and I got the pretty plastic ones. The five containers I got with the lids. I dropped one and it just smashed to smithereens. There was nothing left of it. I was like, you gotta be kidding me. So and been able to find them in the store. So I got pink, a blue, and a purple, and a green. So I love those ones. And I got the last three packs of the double sided tape. That's what I had. And let's see. Let's get some other stuff. Table. We'll just throw right back here in the bag. Some stuff right here because I'm going to show you something. And then I found these decals that you can like put up on the walls or wherever. Oh, I found a magazine too. Small space for organizing, which is what I'm trying to do right now. So, but anyways, I found these. I wanted to um, give it a try and put these on something that I've made. And I'm going to show you in a second what I did. But I found these. It says they're removable. So I'm like, okay, well, hopefully that will work. We'll give it a try. We'll try this out first if that works or how I like it. And then I found these. And these are butterflies. What? I don't know if they open up or not. Yeah. Let's see here. I wanted to open up. See? Yep. Very carefully. Put it together. And that's what it will look like. There's a picture at the top. That's really pretty. So we got this one. We got this one. I wanted bright colors. I don't want no dull colors. And then I found two of these. Which there's no pic oh, the picture's up there. So that's what that one will look like. I thought it was really pretty. So I don't know. We're going to give it a try and see what they're like. I thought these are really pretty. So, but anyways, the reason why I got all this stuff is because I want to show you. So I'm going to take you on a little tour. So just hang on here a second and I'll be right back. Okay, so if you're all wondering what I was doing with four bookshelves, this is what I've done so far. I had plans of making a craft cabinet, but right at this moment, Everything has to stay kind of where it's at because the rug is in the way down here and you cannot put hinges on these. Probably I could put hinges on these this side over here. But all this stuff has got to be sorted through and, and cleaned out anyways. I just basically right now I just picked everything up and kind of just threw it on there. So as you can tell it's quite the mess. So once I get it completely organized, 
then I will show you what it all looks like. But I started over here, and just like right now, I just like I say, putting everything in spots, trying to figure out where I want everything. Like I say, these containers are awesome. So I'm trying to get as many as I can. I want to find some more of these clear containers. Like I say, I dropped one and just smashed it to smithereens. And then down here are those uh, clear drawers. And the clear ones down here, you can see those, are these ones. That's what those look like, so I got some of those. But they fit perfect down here. And then there's some other stuff down there yet I gotta sort through, but I want to take one of the inner, one of the shelves and put all like my new papers and stuff that I just got, and try to keep all my new stuff together, and then go through my old stuff and see what um yeah. But like I said, I just started putting everything around here, just kind of set it up up so it's not on the floor, cause there's a little bit of stuff on the floor yet, but. Like I say, I just gotta go through it all. Gotta get through all that stuff, and yeah, get all that stuff straightened on. And hopefully, sooner or later, I'm gonna have to try and find a way to move this carpet though, because the carpet's in the way. And if you hook these on to the doors, because these are gonna be your doors. Unfortunately, my friend decided that oh well, the board on here should be wide enough. No, it's not. I had to. That's why I'm trying to. Find a way to cover this up because the handles are down here now. I did it on the other door too. I put the handle on. So when you go to close it, you know, the handle stays on. We had to find a way to do it. This is like, um, I don't know. I don't, it's not like, I don't know what kind of board. It's, it's not really thin board. It's kind of a, a I'd say it's pretty good solid piece of wood up with the wood or ply I don't know but anyways yeah so yeah and he cut it I got three pieces the guy cut it one piece in half for me and it just it still overlapped so but yeah there's the handle on the door that's yeah so but I'll fix it so it'll look fine I'll, I'll find a way to fix it so it'll look great so but anyways I just wanted to show you that and, uh, yeah, I'll be back tomorrow because I gotta go to the post office and pick up a package that's at the post office because the mail lady tried to put it in the office. And the office told her, no, don't put it in there. And it's from Atlas, so it's the, um, B-spot. It's coming in. So I'm like, so excited. I'm like, ah, I'm not gonna work until 6 o'clock tomorrow. So, but anyways, I'll talk to y'all later. And have a good night. Yeah, I gotta clean up over there too. Everything's disorder. I don't know. Dis organized. Okay. Bye for now.